This is going to be a quick overview video just to remind you some of the features you'll need to make a flyer. We're going to start out with fonts. So at the top, if you have your headline, several things that you can do to it are change the font size, change the actual font. You can change the alignment to center. If you want a certain text effect, if you hover over these effects, you'll see their name. So they have weird and long names like gradient fill, blue, accent one, reflection. If you're an advanced user, however, you can always create your own effects by changing the color, the weight, adding your own shadows, your own reflections, and glows. A feature that I really like is the theme feature. If you go under design, they have preset themes. You can hover over each theme to see what it looks like, and the names are below them. So once you choose a theme, you may not like the colors, so you can change the color theme as well and hover over those different themes. And if you're an advanced user, you can click Customize Colors and change your own color scheme. And just a tip, I typed some more text, and it looks just the same as my headline. You can click Normal on the Home tab. It'll take it back. Bulleted List is under Paragraph. You can bullet items. You can also add a page border by going to Design, Page Borders, Box, choose what style of line that you'd like, choose the color that you'd like, tell it to apply to the whole document. You can do View, Zoom, and do one page to make sure that your flyer looks good and fits on one page. To insert a picture is under Insert, Pictures, or Online Pictures. You want to find something that fits the theme and you can resize your images you can center your images and to add certain effects just double click the picture if you hover over these picture styles they'll give you their names for instance this one is simple frame black if you're an advanced user you can add your own effects shadow effects if you hover over them they'll give you their names to resize a picture to an approximate size, you want to go up here in this upper right hand corner and this is where you would change those. You can even click the dialog box launcher in the bottom right hand corner to get more specific options. Sometimes you want to add some space between your text and an item. So to do that, it's called paragraph spacing. So I'd go to page layout, paragraph spacing after, and I can increase that. And you'll notice it just increases that space there and you can change it before and after. So just click on the item that you want to add that space to before or after. That's under page layout, paragraph. And if you want to center all of your content on your page vertically, that's page layout, margins, custom margins. We're going to go to the layout tab, vertical alignment, center. And that will move all your stuff centered perfectly on the page so you don't have to worry about it. And that is, the, this is the skills you need to know to create your flyers.